Hi guys. So happy Halloween. And uh, so I'm here today to just uh, go through that MEDB game uh, Excel sheet. And I know I'm missing the Halloween party at Parijat, but I, I promise you this Excel sheet is scary. Okay. So before we begin, I just want to give you a disclaimer that the calculations that I have done is a little different from what the seniors have done. So follow whichever you want. Okay. So I didn't refer to their uh, calculation at all. So let me just share my screen and uh, let's try and solve this. Okay. Okay. So the first scary thing is that the number of tabs I have open. But anyways, so where is the yeah. So this was the question that was given. And these are the rules. Yeah. So these are the rules. And basically, there's a difference in the question that was given. So here, uh, we are asked that we are a TV broadcaster, okay. And we are making money from OTT as well as from TV. Um, initially, the calculation that I had done, I was factoring in the fact that I will uh, get the money from OTT as well. But I don't know if that is correct. Okay. So see, from what I understand from this is that I am only a TV broadcaster. And the programmatic uh, content that I have, I can give it to an OTT channel for the syndication cost. Um, Okay, so let's let's just go through the rules once. Uh, it says that TV broadcaster, you need to figure out which is the most profitable challenge in the regional specialty. Ensure that your plan includes cost of investment. Uh, minimum benchmark is 1000 hours of programming per channel. Okay, uh, each, your channel needs to make additional revenue from OTT platform content licensing. So there are in the data given, you have been given the AVOD and all these things. But it says that you need to make revenue from OTT platform licensing. So what I think of this is that I'm just going to give it to an OTT platform and I'll charge money for it for a per hour. Right. I'll not uh, I'll not charge for it. Like I'll not open a new OTT platform itself. And I'm not giving subscription or advertising revenue, whatever. Right. So that is something that I had taken into, but that data is irrelevant. Uh, each channel, <coughs> sorry, each TV channel needs to acquire 10 pins. The average duration is two hours. There are two kinds of pins that are given, which are um, big pins or medium pins. Okay. Uh, which is the most profitable and why? And you're not allowed to mix genres and exercise in submitted 24 hours. Okay. Now let's go into the Excel sheet. Okay. So before we go into this, this is, this is the data that was given. And we are given that we have uh, so basically what I did initially was that just to make it more simple, just put this comma button, then you'll get a figure of the data. So it's like 500 million. Otherwise, without the commas, you can't really figure out. So I have 500 million uh, with me, and I can take a loan of 1 lakh 50,000 million. So 1500 million, I can take a loan at 8%. And something that Sir's mentioning class was that additional loan would be at 2% extra interest. So anything in extra over this, uh, I would need to take a loan at 10%. Okay. Now media buying cost. So media buying cost from what I Googled. So you, you see, that's why I have so many tabs open. So media buying cost is what the advertise. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. So the media buying cost is the purchase of advertising from a media company such as television. So it's like it's for the advertisers who pay money to the TV channel to get money like for revenue. So I don't think this is a relevant thing. This entire media buying cost is not relevant. Okay, content cost is what is relevant. So content cost, it says that for TV uh, per hour of Hindi content is 25. Uh, so this again, I think. Uh, 2.5 million is the, this. And so I've structured this later. I'll show you everything. Okay. Um, cost feature film is this and revenue is this. Then, so this part is relevant. This content cost part. TV cost, content uh, cost per hour is just the repeating the same thing. 
um, infra manpower, whatever revenue. Okay, so it says revenue per 10 seconds. So per 10 seconds of uh, film content, it's 25,000 per 10 seconds of uh, non film content, it's 12,000. Okay, and so on. Okay, so let's move into the Excel sheet that I made. Um, so this is the syndication cost that I was talking about. So syndication cost, what this is per hour. So basically every time I make a original content, I can license that to uh, another OTT channel who can run my content. Um, so like they'll take my content and run it on their OTT platform and per hour of original content that I give them, I'll take from them 15,000. So this entire thing, subscribers and AVOD, SVOD, I think this is not relevant. Okay. Feature film cost, I'll, I'll get into this. Again, for feature film cost, this cost of uh, big cost, small cost, revenue cost, these things are for the producer of that film. For me, I'm just a TV broadcaster. So for me, I think only the TV right is what is relevant for me. It, everything else is irrelevant. Okay, uh, active programming hours. So this is something that Sir had mentioned in class that uh, active programming hours is the hours for which you can run uh, ads on the channel. So for example, 7 a.m. to 12 p.m. So it's 12 hours plus five hours, so 17 hours. So 17 hours you can run ads on the channel. Rest of the hours you can't run ads on the channel. Inventory fill. Uh, inventory fill means 60% means that if for every hour of content that is played on TV, you are allowed to put 12, 12 minutes of uh, ads on the channel. Out of that 12 minutes, 60% of that is filled. So initially, because it's a new TV channel, you won't have 100% uh, inventory fill. So that's what inventory fill means. And the revenue is given, everything else, else is given. Okay, so what I did basically is, okay, so as I said, it's a scary Excel sheet. So don't worry, we'll just go through <coughs> yeah so uh, we'll go through everything uh, so here it says that revenue so firstly what we have to do is to calculate the revenue for each bracket of him so let's let's hide the regional for now i've done the calculation for everything but for now just let's just hide this because um, you'll get scared or <laughs> okay just joking um, yeah. Right. Okay. So let's just take Hindi for now. Okay. So in Hindi, there are three things. One is a big film, a medium film, and original Hindi content. Now revenue per hour. So revenue, what it's saying is that uh, for a film the revenue is 25,000. So if you see over here, it was mentioned that for Hindi uh, film, the revenue is here. Uh, for film and non-film, it was mentioned that, um, where is it, where was it? Not this. I can't find it, where is it? Yeah, here. So revenue per 10 seconds of films of 12,000 um, is the cost for non-film and for film is 25,000. So I've just taken that. So 12,000 is for, uh, so because it's a film, either in, uh, big or small, a uh, big or medium, in both cases, it's 2,500, uh, 25,000 per 10 seconds. Okay. Now for every minute, uh, for every hour, uh, for every advertising hour, like for every hour, we are allowed to uh, run uh, ad ads for only 12 minutes. So 12 minutes, now advertising fill is 60%. So for every hour of content that is played, we can only get, get a revenue of 1.0, excuse me. So I, we can get a revenue of 1.08 million. Right, so it's 25,000 divided by 10, so that's per second into 60. So here, 20 divided by 10 into 60 into uh, this one uh, per minute, so that's per hour, and then 60%. Okay, right. 
okay so this is the revenue for film and this is the revenue for non film right now for film for film what i am doing is i am buying that film from a producer i can't license that film further but for a non film something i can so this this third column is my original content that i am making so for that content i can um, license that to an ott platform to run so maybe i'm making a serial and that serial i can license that to an ott platform so that is 15000 um so 15000 i have added over here it was given in the syndication cost here syndication rate per hour so this was a per hour so i have directly taken that revenue was per 10 seconds so i had to calculate in this way i hope this part is clear advertising minutes is 12 minutes per hour and advertising fill so i let me write inventory fill in fact inventory fill yeah so inventory fill is like 60% of that so in the next one region was 75 and then 50 so 60% of my advertising slots are filled right so these are the revenues from one hour of film okay so i have got the revenue now i have to calculate the cost of the film so the cost of the film is what the cost of the film is tv rights so tv rights is given so to run that on tv i have to buy this right now i have to buy this right either for a so what i have done over here is instead of calculating it per film i have calculated it for like i have to calculate per hour okay so i have to buy 10 films either small or medium yes sir sir big or medium so i have taken that i am assuming that i am buying 10 big films so what is my cost per hour for big films and what is my cost per hour for medium films so i have in both case i have taken 10 10 i'll show you why so that i can get a per hour cost for each okay <coughs> if you take 5 5 also it will be the same like ultimately if you choose to run 5 films it will be the same thing okay so 45 uh, 450 million is the cost of one tv right for one film okay i'll buy 10 films so uh, 400 uh, 4500 million is the cost total tv right cost now I, this was given in the question that you can during the day you can run two films maximum so two films is equal to four uh, hours so two hours per film and then four films uh, sorry four hours so two uh, two hours per film into two is four uh maximum film hours per year is 4 into 365 so this is my tot- maximum film hours per year okay so maximum film hours per year is this cost of tv right is this much uh right so this is my cost per hour of uh tv right of film so cost per hour of film okay let me write cost of cost of film per hour got it don't take the cost of making the film and then marketing and inventory those things because those are incurred by the producer of the film i'm just buying the licensing okay so after that um uh, cost of original content so cost of original content is here so what what are the costs that are given so first is a content cost as i said media buying cost is a cost that uh, initially i had taken also so uh, i don't have the sheet i think yeah here so i had done this calculation which i think this was wrong um content cost is the only cost media buying cost is incurred by the advertisers okay so content cost i have taken as uh, it was given uh, 2500 uh, million so no 2.5 million infrastructure uh, and manpower was given as 30% okay so you take 30% of that uh, it was given here that if you come here you'll say that infrastructure and manpower was 30 25 45 okay so that's how i have taken that production cost total is the total of the two right 2500 plus this now i am making 1000 hours of programmatic content uh, i can make more but then i incur more cost so that's not my point so it was given minimum i have to make 1000 hours so i'll make 1000 hours of programmatic content so total my production cost is this into 
ओके सो थ्री थाउजेंड टू हंड्रेड फिफ्टी मिलियन मार्केटिंग कॉस्ट वॉज ऑल्सो गिवन सो आई डेट अप एंड देन दिस इज द टोटल कॉस्ट ऑफ ऑरिजिनल कॉन्टेंट एंड आई हैव डिवाइडेड बाय द ओरिजिनल रनिंग टाइम ऑफ ओरिजिनल कॉन्टेंट सो आई होप पीपल आर लिसनिंग एंड जस्ट नॉट कॉपिंग माई असाइनमेंट ओके I don't think people are listening, but anyways, uh, so how I've calculated this is basically three hundred sixty-five into twelve into twenty-four is my entire duration I can run um, the channel. From that, I have reduced the time for the film hours. So here, one four six zero is the film hours. I have reduced that part. Whatever is left is my hours for uh, original content. So fourteen sixty is the maximum time that I can run. Uh, uh films the rest of the time i have to run this content so i have divided that by 7300 so production cost per running hour is coming to this okay so this is the main calculation part rest is real easy okay so firstly what i have done is taken revenue per hour so this is the revenue from hour from the note one below okay now i have taken advertising hours so advertising hours was given as uh, 17 hours during the day from 7 am to 12 uh, pm like midnight right so out of that what i have done is that i am assuming that i have to make uh, i have to purchase films that is a assumption that i am making because uh, per hour revenue from films in both cases you see it's 1080 and the cost of that film is much higher okay so if we we had seen the calculations and uh, i am assuming the calculations are correct uh, you can see that the cost is very high compared to the revenue that i am making from film which is possible because it's just a new channel and uh, which is almost possible so nothing to worry about there okay um, so ideally i if if i was the uh, person running the channel i would run so <coughs> i would run 24 hours of programmatic content because in films i'm losing money by running films but i'm assuming that for 4 hours of films i have to run okay so 4 hours of film i have to run because my revenue from that is higher uh, so i i put that uh, as the advertising hours and uh, 13 remaining 13 hours i put in original content okay uh i know people are saying de do bar excel sheet de do hum copy kar lete hain i know um but theek hai uh, itna bana liya to bana hi dete hain hmm theek hai so uh, this is the cost of the film uh, so see the cost of cost of a big film is much higher than the medium film obviously but the revenue that i am making is the same so in this case it's more profitable if or i am making less loss if i buy uh, a small film got it uh, so i am i am taking that's why i have chosen 4 hours here and not here okay uh, cost of original content um okay so again the cost of the film are taken from below note 2 and cost of original content note 3 from below okay from here cost of film from here and cost of original content from here now uh, running hours so running hours for this 24 hours the channel is running advertising is only running for 17 hours okay so for uh, this what i have done is i have allocated so 4 hours is this much remaining hours even though there will not be advertising this content will run so that's what i am doing i am just running that content for 20 hours now to run that content um, i am incurring this much cost per hour people are calling me for the solution uh, wait one second i'll just pause sorry so people were calling me for the hands anyways so yeah so you'll get the answers i think uh, i don't know i have asked my team and uh, if if they say no i blame them i i'm not to blame okay i'm making the video uh, you can use this but uh, if if i'm not sharing the uh, 
exegete then blame my team okay okay so yeah um, so i'm multiplying this 20 hours into the cost and this 4 hours into this cost so this is my total cost this is my total revenue okay and uh, yeah this is the gross profit per day i told you this is a very bad excel sheet I, I'm, I'm like okay now what is how much loan should i take is the total cost i'm assuming that i'll incur the cost upfront and then i'll keep in uh, keep getting the revenue back from my uh, channel okay so initially the total cost per annum is this into 365 so that's my total cost available funds i have 500 uh, million with me i don't need to pay any interest on that uh, our, um, on, on top of that i have to take 300 um, million of loan at eight percent and remaining 3700 million of loan at 10 percent so if you total that up uh, you get this entire uh, 5700 which is your total cost okay um and the interest per day is again this this into eight percent this into ten percent divided by 365 net profit per day uh, so you just uh, reduce this one so gross profit minus interest is net profit okay so yeah that's it so i've done that for all three i'll show you the answers so that you can get an idea and uh, knowing me i'll probably share the answers so anyways uh, so this is the so uh, for me it came as regional was the best possible bet because it's the least possible loss that i'm incurring here compared to specialty and hindi okay uh, specialty there's no uh, like uh, film so that's why it's just original content right so one thing that i have not done in specialty is i have not divided this by i have to click this yeah okay so yeah so specialty again uh, i've done so i don't know if i'll be sharing this one like anyways yeah i hope you got an idea at least of how you have to approach this again this is entirely my excel sheet uh, what the seniors have done last year is very different okay so i'll show you that as well i have it open over here okay so what they have done is again active programming hours was given as 18 hours break uh, 12 minutes per hour minutes of inventory is again same, similar just in our case is going to see given 7 am to 12 pm okay um manpower infra and manpower revenue inventory fill most of it is the same what they've done is cost of content they have calculated per year and i've calculated per hour okay and then i've taken my decision their decision is based on Per year and then uh, their revenue has come to 61 percent is the profitability then they have taken this part which i have not checked it in detail so i'm not sure if this is correct or not uh, yeah so use your discretion whichever you want to this is much simpler i might be wrong i'm not sure uh, yeah so I just wanted to record this part of what I have done so far. Might change it. Uh, I'll just go through this. I don't know. Uh, so I know as soon as I post this video, people are going to tell me to send the Excel sheet. So okay, okay. Happy Hall Halloween! I hope you haven't gotten scared too much. I I'm sure you have not watched this to the entire end. If you have um thank you and yeah okay bye